Hello and welcome to King Pasha's Garage where we look at some crazy tunes in my garage and this is one of them. I'm pretty sure if you saw that 4 minute and 15 second video, it's one less thing I have to show about this car. This thing's got 1,017 horsepower. It's something um, to drift. Uh, it's got a stock tire compound uh, and here's the share code again for you guys. Got it? Great. Let's get right into it, show you guys everything I've done to this thing. Um, and we'll wait until we get to that tune. It, it, I, I put so much into it just to get it to uh, drift. I tried different, um, I tried a supercharger, turbocharger. Um, you only have two engine options here. Um, and the most power you can get is the 6.2 liter V8 to give you 1,017 horsepower. I tried the supercharger with 1,015 horsepower but then came back to using a turbocharger. Of course, it's just a stock uh, drivetrain, all-wheel drive, and the, uh, the twin turbo. I, I, I tried this thing, and I said, eh, it didn't work, and then I, I went right back to this. It's kind of funny, it doesn't say that I, you know, I, I had it, you know, like I own it, because I definitely used it. And uh, yeah, it was, it was broken because when I went to upgrade with the supercharger, it said I only had 974 horsepower. And I had to uh, go back in there and buy a stock flywheel, put it back, the stock flywheel back on just so then, or, or whatever, just to uh, let it have the power. It would not let me have it. Uh -oh. By going from a turbocharger to a supercharger, it said, nope, you're, you only got uh, 700 and, I mean, like 971 horsepower. And it was like, well, that's odd. Anyways, we got a stock tire compound on this. And then uh, stock in the front, stock in the rear, as you can tell, to get this thing to slide as much as you can. Uh, and as you could probably tell in, the, in that video, it didn't slide very, very well. Um, it was very surprising. Um, it's got my TC 105 ends or my favorite rims are at the bottom here uh, And uh, yeah, it, it, it's a it's a crazy car. We got just regular stocks in the front and in the back I wanted to keep this thing as light as possible Even though we had a body kit on there and then I also made sure that the track lifts were also inward so then I would you know I would slide more because um, as you can tell, even for the off-road, it, it, it goes into green, so it's definitely uh, gripping. And the handle line, see, it's, it's saying it, it's better grip. We don't want grip. We want to slide. And you also tell, and can tell that this car is not lowered. Um, that's where I had issues with this thing. Um, and the moment I raised it up as high as it could go, it actually drifted just fine. All right, it's got a drift differential. It's got race brakes. It does have drift springs and dampeners on there. anti roll bars, both the front and the rear. Really had to work on those guys. Uh, I decided just to max them out. Um, I, I, it, it just felt off with it. Uh, I, I put them all the way down the soft and the, the, the car just went ballistic when you went around turns. I don't know what was going on. Uh, it's got a race weight reduction, so we're saving 464 pounds uh, with that. But uh, this is definitely uh, meant for uh, off-road rally, handling off-road in dirt and mud, whatever. Uh, it, it, it definitely is not a pavement um, car. Um, by any means when it comes to trying to uh, get this thing to go sideways. It is very well balanced of a car and uh, Yeah, so it was definitely a challenge uh, To say the least as you can tell I had to buy all this stuff just to um, Get all that power out of the supercharger and it was just such a headache that I went right back to the turbocharger And it gave me the power that I wanted uh, so if you buy a turbo first and then buy the supercharger and try to upgrade it, you're gonna you'll see there's 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 problems that, that happen in that thing. Um, or it's just me. Who knows? Uh, here's my tune. Here's here's what I've done to it. 
All right, so I think tell it's 55, 55 on the skinniest tires on stock tire compound, and it doesn't slide that you know as as well as you would think. You would think the power uh, would push you through, and it it, it just struggled. Um, and for that, I had to really lower the gears um, to really um, keep it um, rev happy. Uh, so we had to do that. The uh, alignment is uh, 2.3. Uh, negative 5, 3, 0, 5, 0, and 7, 0. And that's what we did there. Uh, the anti-roll bars were at 1.1, 1.11, whatever. Um, and it just added funky. It was just funky around the, uh, you know, sliding. And once I put it to 65, 65, it finally smoothed out. It worked. Um, and then this is what I did to it. I tried soft. I went, I took this, you know, and I went all the way down. And the lowest you can go is like 281 around there, you know. And I tried soft, medium, and I found out that, you know, this is a rally car. It, it's, you know, usually it's soft for a rally. And if you're going to drift on pavement, you might as well just make it stiff. And then as soon as I wrote, made this right height go up, because you can get this thing go down to 5'3 for both the front and the rear, um, it really just becomes a magnet on the on the on the tarmac um it is really meant for for handling grip whatever so once i put up the 7.4 it finally broke loose and went sideways and you know and it's still not you know it's still not there uh dampening this is not a mistake it actually is what i, I use um and it worked uh well on there i first tried 7968 and it didn't work um, I, I didn't like how the car handled um, in transitions. So when I did this, it, it, it helped it a little bit more. Uh, there's no uh, downforce, uh, braking 70% to in the front with 130% pressure. And you're going to see my differential is all the way down to 53%. I first tried 84%, 80, uh, 71%. Uh, 68%, 66%, 65%. Um, yeah, it, I, I just kept on having to go down further and further to uh, balance out the power because anything higher than this, you're gonna, your your back end's really gonna just flip back and forth, back and forth like a like a fish in the water, um, like their tail. You know, that's exactly what. They felt like uh, on pavement so uh, that's uh that's the tune that's what i did to it um you know it it definitely was a uh a crazy uh tune all together but yeah I, I think you guys are gonna you know i i i got it all done for you see i haven't even put anything else on here like you know so everything is just like stock for the car mastery for this 2004 and there you have it uh like I said, the video is there on, on Cara Esta, um, so you guys can uh, see uh, what we what we did with it. Um, so I, I got, you know, I took the pain of tuning away from you. All you have to do is use mine. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace out and stay sideways, my friends.